We've always been an institution which has led in the teaching and learning area and we want to continue to be at the forefront of that. Uh, the future is wearables in terms of mobile uh, devices, whether that's the Apple Watch or the Google Glasses. Uh, and eventually that will move on to implantables. You know, students uh, will come to us with implanted mobile devices and that'll help them with their learning. Um, I know it sounds a little bit radical at the moment, but it's technology that's already with us and uh, I guess will be rolled out into the future. All of this year we've been uh, implementing the planning that we did at the end of last year. Uh, from a curriculum perspective, we've completed our rapid review of all of our courses. So across the entire university, we now have a very clear idea of how our courses are performing in terms of their compliance with regulations, uh, whether we've put leadership and work integrated learning and Indigenous learning and research, uh, how much that's embedded into our curriculum. And we've got a really good snapshot across all of our courses in the university as to how we're performing in those areas. We've made assessments of our courses for new markets, for learning engagement, for industry engagement. And what we're doing is prioritising from that rapid review and actually moving into the ART 2015 process. So ART stands for Assessment, Review of the Curriculum and Transformation of the Curriculum. And we are hoping that by the end of 2015, we will have put every course through an ART process and we'll have made that um, transformation for the future. Part of the student experience uh, means that we need to make that experience much more exciting, much more alive for our students. We need to provide them with a really seamless experience so that it's very easy to use. Uh, they can find access to all the things they want at Curtin and that we make all of our processes streamlined so that uh, students come in and, and really love being at Curtin. We've got a lot of projects in the Transforming Learning at Curtin strategy. Uh, they relate to retention, to work integrated learning, the Curtin Learning Institute and professional learning for our staff. We're tackling some of our processes, so timetabling is one. So there are lots of projects that are actually going on that all complement the changes to curriculum. We already have a lot of excellent programs here at Curtin and it's not like we're starting from a greenfield site. We've got lots of courses that have already transformed and are doing wonderful, innovative things. Uh, but the world is changing. Uh, 12 months, 18 months ago, massive online open courses, MOOCs, came into being and that offers content free to the world. So students now have amazing choice about where they study. Lots of different companies have come into the competitive arena, whether it's Coursera or edX or Udacity and, and in fact tens of, of others. Uh, and they're competing with us now. So we have to be much uh, sharper, we have to be aware of the global competition. We have to move towards a future where students can study in any location at any time of their choosing and in a really flexible way.